Hi YouTube, my name is Michelle Brown. Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be creating this look for you guys using the LA Girl Pro makeup products. So if you'd like to see how I achieve this look, stay tuned. Please don't forget to like, subscribe, and share. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye. Okay guys, we're gonna get started with our brows using the LA Girl Shady Slim Brow Pencil. Okay, and the color is blackest brown. I'm gonna use a spoolie at the end to brush up our brows. You wanna make sure your eyebrows are nice and clean. Just clean them up today. so we won't break it. Just fill in the top and the bottom. There you go. You can see more what I'm doing here. I like the pencil, it's pretty easy to use. Now we're going to use the LA Girl Pro Concealer. Everyone knows this one. In the color Fawn to conceal my brows or to clean up my brows. I'm going to use this um, flat brush here that I purchased from the website um, Wish just to test it out. It's like a flat rounded at the top brush. Take your time when you do your brows. Because I think the brows make your whole face. I'm going to put this all over my lid. And I purchased this 
brush set guys from Amazon plus BS, BS Mall it comes in a pack of um, like 15, 15 so I'm going to use one of them to blend out my concealer I'm going to use this one And I couldn't find a um, concealer or a darker one to put above my brow, so I'm going to use the same fawn. I'm just going to mix it on the back of my hand with this one, and this color is a darker shade. I'm just going to mix them together to clean up the top part of my brow. Using the same brush. Now, I couldn't really find a loose powder, LA Girl loose powder, so I bought this one. And this one is Creamy Natural LA Girl Pro Face High Definition. Okay, I'm going to use that to set my brow. Let's hope it's not too light using the same brush. Now, for the eyeshadow palette, I'm going to use this one here, LA Girl Pro Artistry Eyeshadow Palette. Okay, and these are the colors that we have, mostly neutral colors. So I'm going to do a neutral look, and I'm going to use this brush. I'm gonna use this color here as my transition shade.
now I'm going to use this um, burgundy color here, like a plum color, this color. I'm going to put that on the outer corners of my eye using this um, like rounded brush. Part of her lid. I'm gonna use this flat brush here and then since I use the plum looking color um, the matte color I'm going to use this color here which is more like a shimmer color on the inner part of my um, eye with their finger. And whatever I can't get, if I can't get to the corner, then I'll go back with the brush. brush that we used before. I think I want a little bit more color on the outer part so I'm going to use this brown here just to make it a little darker. Okay guys, so I really wanted to make this the LA Girl look affordable look, but I could not find everything that I need. I'm not sure if they have, but um, I went to um, CVS and this is what I found. So I'm going to try to make it work. That's pretty. Okay, so for foundation, before I do my foundation, I'm going to use the LA Girl Pro, the orange color, just to conceal under my eyes, my mustache area, or any discoloration that I have to cover that up first. makeup wipe here to make sure that I don't have any eyeshadow underneath. Alright, but before we do anything, LA Girl Pro Prep High Definition Primer. We're going to primer face. This is my first time using I did not try any of these things except for the um, Pro Concealer in Fawn 
which we all use. And this is like a, um, it's kind of like a, I guess silicone. It's not creamy. So it feels nice. Alrighty. And now we're gonna conceal. Or color correct, I should say. to mix the espresso color with the fawn. I hope it worked because this looks kind of dark. Yeah, this color by itself. Ooh, too dark, baby. Too dark. Look at that. That will be too dark for my face. So since I want to use LA Girl mostly, to mix a little bit of the fawn with that to see if I can get my shade. Right, let's mix it together. I don't know. I don't know if that's gonna work guys. Maybe. brush from the same pack to blend that out. Okay.
gonna put like a dab here. Of course, and a dab here with the other lighter color. What do we think? I think it's too dark. Alright, I'm gonna go back with the LA Girl Fawn by itself to conceal under my eyes. my nose, my forehead, and Cupid's bow on a little bit on my chin. Not too much on my chin. Then we're going to use our beauty beauty sponge from this website called Shop Miss A, the letter the, the, the letter A, and I purchased this sponge for like um maybe probably two dollars and it's really good and it's really soft it's damped so i just put a little bit of my setting spray because i washed this a while ago and then we're gonna use that to blend out the concealer Use our foundation brush to make sure we blend out the edges. Now I couldn't really find a loose setting powder, so I'm going to use my black radiance one. Just this one. In the color banana. Yeah, banana. I'm going to use that to set my I didn't open it. I want to look up to make sure you have no creasing. And then just blend it out. I'm going to push it in. Push it on the side of your nose. Even though I didn't conceal my smile lines, I'm going to put some there. Like so. And I'll just put some on my forehead. Let's 
try to snatch this nose a little bit. Delete my eye so I can um, do my under under eye shadow. And we don't want any fallout. So I'm gonna use the same palette, of course. And we're gonna use these two colors here. The burgundy looking one and the brown one. And I'm gonna use this brush, like a pencil brush, to do that. Girl Glide Eye Glide Gel Liner, and the color is very black to put in my waterline. It's very soft, actually. powder LA girl pro face powder okay and this color is called warm caramel so I'm going to use that to dust off the powder off my face are the parts where I didn't put the um, setting powder I'm going to, need to set my face know how this is going to work but actually this brush that I'm using is called beauty concepts my favorite powder brush I think it came from Ross my friend Erica gave it to me thank you Erica that's the only brush I use to do my powder. I love it. Big and fluffy. Okay. All right. I'm gonna try something. I'm gonna try to use this big fluffy brush here and use in this color, which is the lighter color that we put underneath her brows before. Just see if I can brighten up under my eyes just a bit. Not too bright. Nothing on it. I didn't put anything extra on the brush. Okay, so I'm going to contour my face. I couldn't find a contour palette for LA Girl, so I'm going to contour my face with the Black Radiance True Complexion palette. And we're going to be using this middle color middle color here the contour face I'm gonna use this brush to do so
I'm going to use this brush to contour my nose. I like to take it like up to the middle of my brow here and then bring it back down. powder. I'll put it in the middle. Make sure my contour is not crooked. I'm going to use this e.l.f. liquid liner. I couldn't find one for LA Girl. Not sure if they have it, but for now we'll use the e.l.f. liquid liner in the color black. To do a little wing. Okay guys, so what I'm going to do now, I'm going to step off camera to do my lashes because I'm not that skilled. And then I'll be right back. I am back. I did my lashes off camera. I found this these lashes um, called New Cali Faux Mink Lashes. And it came in this little pack. I think it's about, how many? Maybe like um, nine pairs. Or 10. Can you guys see that? Okay, so now that we put on our lashes, I'm going to set my face here with this LA Girl setting spray. Okay. Could not find uh, mascara, so I'm using the um, Rimmel Scandal Eyes. Scandal Eyes. I'm gonna put it on my lower lash line. I hope you guys saw that. First, I'm going to put it underneath these long lashes. Oh, 
forgot to put on blush, so we're gonna use Rimmel again. We have this color, it's like a peachy color. What does that say? Sweet, sweet chairs. Let's put that on our cheeks. I don't think you can really see that. Okay, I'm going to mix it with this other color. It's more like a um, a plum color. And whatever I don't tell you guys now, I will make sure I list them in the um, description section. It's more like a plummy color, Rimmel, because I think the other one didn't really show up on my skin as much. This one's a little bit better. other brush from the set and I'm going to use my MAC Oh Darling highlighter this is not drugstore but this is what I had to highlight my this is not a highlighting brush but just highlight my face a little bit all of my brushes today another one my inner tear duct It's called berry wine. Okay, we're gonna put that on. found this lipstick which I feel like it's too light LA girl it's like a peachy color which I don't think this is the right color
I guess it would be like an ombre lip color. Hmm. That's pretty. And I also found a lip gloss from them. It looks like that. Glaze lip paint. coming up brighter on camera it will have to do All right, guys I'm gonna put a little bit more color in my inner tear duct That's what we have. Okay guys, so that's the end of my makeup tutorial. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I do and I did enjoy using most of the um, LA Girl products. I think they came out pretty nice, you know, so you don't have to break the bank trying to look pretty because I think I look pretty today. So, um I hope you guys enjoy it. Please again, don't forget to like, subscribe, and share. I use mostly LA Girl products, but the few that I couldn't find, I use what I had. So enjoy this look, and um, I'll see you guys next time. Bye.